This week we're going to create a memory card game. You should have already downloaded the Memory Start FLA. I want to take you on a quick tour of it and we need to get you set up to be ready to program. This week we're going to do something that we haven't done before. We're going to use an external action script file and it's a little bit different than what we've been doing. If you open up the library you'll see that you have the MC Cards movie clip. The rest of these are assets for that movie clip. And we can go into the properties for this and you'll see that we have actually given it a named class and it's named MC for movie clip cards. It's important that that be named and that it is set up so that we can use it um, from our external file. So you have to name it and it has to be exported for ActionScript. That's already done for you. The next thing that we have to do is in the properties we need to actually create our document class which will be card class with a capital C for class and then I'm going to hit edit it doesn't exist so we're going to create it and we want to go edit that by default when we start editing it's going to create an external action script file which we will need to save in the same folder and we have to save it by that name, cardclass.as. So you want to make sure that your memory game and the card class are in a folder together and save them. You'll notice that it automatically imports a package for the display.movieclip. It's a package name that we're creating. Our external file is always a package. And it's got a public class, card class, extending movie clip because we're extending the movie clip functionality. It will create our constructor code, which is a public function card class. Public means that we can access it from outside. Get all this set up, save it, save them in the folder structure, and then we can move on and we can start programming our external file.